I'm sure you've all heard of different kinds of deviled food and that's what we're going to talk about today. I'm sure you all heard of deviled eggs, right? The nice creamy filling that's made from the yolk of a hard boiled egg and flavored with mayonnaise and some other spices. And we eat it as kind of a little side dish for some of our picnics and meals. So that's a deviled egg. I'm sure you've heard of deviled crab, where you take crab meat and enhance it with different flavors and make crab cakes or crab filling. There's deviled ham, and some people mix that with um, relish and different things to come up with a flavored chopped up ham. Well, today we're going to try something different, and that is a deviled avocado. And when I started to think about how uh, these avocados are served as a deviled food, <laughs> I thought, well, I'd look around. Well, what I found mostly on the internet was that people are taking their deviled eggs and they're making guacamole from the avocado and stuffing it in the deviled egg instead of using egg yolks. Well, that's some cool way to eat an egg, but I'd like to take the avocado and stuff it with something because I found that deviled food means that it's a food that's enhanced, possibly spicier, possibly just richer filling or something that makes it more hopped up than the usual. <laughs> so let's take the avocado and we'll make a deviled avocado in a different way. Okay, I have a nice healthy looking avocado here. It's perfectly ripe, has a little bit of give to it, a nice dark color. This is from Mexico. So we're going to cut this in half and take the seed out. So all I do is take a knife, cut through the thick skin, and um, cut down to the seed, going all the way around. And then we're going to twist it to take it apart. Okay, look how nice that is inside. Nice and green, and it's also a little bit squishy, meaning it's perfectly ripe. Now I take my sharp knife and I just whack the seed and twist it, and the seed comes out nice and clean. Now we have two beautiful halves. Now this is going to be very simple how we stuff these and make them double. I'm going to use some roasted red pepper hummus. And this is a brand that I think is really delicious. It has um, some nice roasted red peppers in the middle of the creamy hummus. So I'm simply going to take an ice cream scoop and get a nice scoop out of here and put it right in the center of the avocado where the seed was. I'm going to do that with both halves. And this is going to make a rather healthy snack because the hummus is something that's very good for you too. Now the, the avocado itself is a nutritional powerhouse. This is loaded with over 20 essential vitamins and nutrients. It's a good source of fiber but it also has potassium, vitamin E, B vitamins, folic acid, so you can't go wrong by having a snack that's like this. Now, we are going to enhance it a little bit. The hummus is made from sesame seeds. And we're just going to sprinkle some more sesame seeds right on top. For some more nutrients there. And good taste. And then I'm going to take some paprika. Which you can use smoky paprika. Or you can use... Um, just the regular, that's what this is. We're going to drop some of that on there just like it was a deviled egg for some color and also some good taste. Okay, and then I'm going to take a little bit of the roasted red pepper out of the center of the hummus container and I'm going to put that right on top. Okay, now who wouldn't want to snack on this? This is a good side dish for a party or it's good for just a snack when you're sitting around with your friends and family. 
So we're going to put this on a plate. And I'm going to add some nice Triscuit crackers. This is the Hint of Salt cracker and it's really tasty. We're going to put some in the dish to serve this. I don't think you could make an easier nutritious snack than what you see here. And you can use a spoon to scoop it out or you can use the crackers to dip in because the avocado is nice and soft and the hummus is in there. Oh my gosh, this is a beautiful snack. Thanks for watching.